SMT Nation, we back. Nation, I want to talk a little bit about a segment of this article from Mike Dano Light Reading, specifically the part on fixed wireless access T-Mobile's 5G home internet. Kind of looking at some of the mentions within the article, and I want to make my predictions on what quarter two results will be like for the business segment for T-Mobile for Q2. So I'll give you my prediction based off of what analysts are saying. And then I actually, I want to do a little bit of a kind of like a yes rest of the year outlook. All right, so a uh, quick little video for you guys here. We won't take too much of your time, uh, but we'll get you up to speed on this. And uh, I'll look forward to reading what you guys have to say in the comment section. But the article will be linked in the description for you all. Also in the description is the real SMT Buy Me a Coffee link. This is how you could support your creators. Folks, you can buy us a coffee. Link is there in the description. There's other ways to support us as well. Check those things out there there. And of course, if you're looking for a really good deal on wireless service, you can get it from our partner, Mint Mobile. Just make sure that you use our partner link. It's in the description or, you know, just go ahead and type in mintmobile.com forward slash need. Do your shopping. Get a great deal on wireless service. They got phone deals. They got service deals. They're legendary customer care. And of course, you'll be supporting the channel in the process. Okay, so the, the fixed wireless access piece for uh, T-Mobile's 5G home internet is a big piece of their future. It's a new revenue stream for them. It's a big point of emphasis at the earnings calls. Investors are looking at it as a stimulus, a jump start to the new T-Mobile company. And it's got great momentum. Our right, customers are really taking to it. Uh, we're seeing 500 plus thousand you know, new subscribers every quarter since it officially launched full scale national. And uh, it, it's, been, it's been excellent. They're single-handedly you know, putting the dampening on cable companies like Comcast and Charter. You know, their growth has completely been derailed. Meanwhile, those companies have been gaining, you know, sickening amounts of wireless customers. Uh, but T-Mobile is definitely taking their share in the home broadband situation. Proof of this coming from some data points. Uh, according to financial analysts at Evercore, the downloading volume for T-Mobile's 5G home internet app has accelerated into June, right? So remember, we're just talking about Q2 here. So we're not counting July, you know, for these first couple weeks, but June appears to be something of a, an uptick in downloads. It, they did note though, the same analyst said that the app download rate is lower than it was during the holidays, but they are still expecting 500,000 T-Mobile 5G home internet ads for the quarter. And they're assuming that there is probably going to be a continuous decline in churn rate that they saw for the service in Q1. Okay, so we got this same, you know, disclosures from the CFO, you know, about a month or two ago. Uh, it was just a few weeks ago, possibly. You know, it, it just goes to show you, you know, when Mike Sievert, the CEO, said, you know, there's Toyotas and Ferraris and, you know, Toyotas are where it's at. They're reliable. People are willing to pay for them. You know, there's value and all those types of things. It really does seem to show. So the app is showing downloads. People are going to download the app if they have the service, right? So that they continue to expand the service, right? They're upgrading tower sites across the country. They're getting more spectrum. Uh, we're expecting at some point the rest of their N41 licenses, 2.5 gigahertz from Spectrum Auction 108 to get cleared. You know, they've got some DoD and C-band they got to build out. Uh, and they're getting into new parts of rural America. So they're going to continue to take wherever they pass addresses, they're in play. They're in play to take from fiber if it's expensive. They're in play to take from explosive pricing at cable. They're in play to take from Verizon if the customer is willing to, you know, take the T-Mobile internet service because they have the T-Mobile wireless service, they can get a discount, right? They're in play against DSL and satellite. Everywhere they go, they are in play, All right? So the... You know, Verizon's obviously kicking up their, you know, expansion with the rest of their C-band. They're going to be upgrading and building sites too. But I, I look, my expectation, I think 500,000 ads of fixed wireless 5G home internet for T-Mobile is easy. I think that is like clockwork. You know, to me, that is absolutely the base case. I think a strong quarter shows 550,000. And I think a blowout quarter consists of 600, 650,000. And I still think... They've got a couple more quarters like this. But once Verizon gets the rest of C-Band, once cable kind of gets all their DOCSIS going and their upgraded network, it's going to get harder and harder for T-Mobile to grow. But they are approaching 4 or 5 million subscribers here, 
with the end game being seven to eight million, they're gonna get there. T-Mobile's in play, folks. They're a fierce competitor in home broadband. They put their service out there. Customers have the ability to take it. Good with the price, good with the experience. You know, T-Mobile tells us the churn rate is down, it's decreasing. Those are all good indications that people are gonna try the service and they're gonna keep it. And of course, we know how customers are. If they're paying a fair price, and the service is acceptable, and they're getting what they're paying for, they're satisfied. They ain't going anywhere. All right, so T-Mobile's got a good recipe for success here. What do you guys have to say, though? What's your prediction? What do you think is going to happen? What's your take on all this? Love to hear what you guys have to send us. Let's go ahead and hashtag T-Mobile, hashtag home internet for all the real ones that watch this all the way through. But comment down below. You are the voice of the people, the SMT Nation. Let your voice be heard.